Hello kings and queens and welcome back to another episode of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Last episode, we got lost. We were so close to. So I kind of looked up what I had to do. You have to read this diary. On this desolate plateau, the only pleasure that brings me comfort is cooking. And today, I outdid myself. Truly, I created the perfect dish. I call it spicy meat and seafood fry. This recipe not only restores health, but it also keeps me warm even when traveling in the snowy mountains. With this dish on my side, I will no doubt need to have need to... <sighs> English. I no longer ne have need of that itchy warm double. I do not know how I allowed this to happen, but it seems I forgot to write down a very important recipe. I know it contained raw meat and a spicy pepper. However, I simply cannot remember what else I used. My age is catching up to me. Sadly, on this lonely plateau, I have only my own knowledge and memory to rely on. Still, if I did find someone who knew the missing ingredient, I would happily reward them with my warm double. I hope that I hope that I'm pronouncing that right. So, and also while we're here, let's steal the axe because I oh, can't carry anymore. I think my I think my axe is about to break, so let's just sword's about to yeah, it's just about to break, so we want to drop that and take that. Cool, 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 cool. All right, let's go talk to him. Tell him we read his diary. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. How is your shrine exploration going? This body of mine isn't what it used to be. Recovering from a boo of hard work takes a while. If you're hungry, I have an empty pot you can use to cook yourself a meal. You got any tips, bro? Simply open your inventory, grab hold of your ingredients, and toss them in. Try to consider how the ingredients will complement one another. So you can even make a dish that increases your stamina. Oh, yeah, that's useful. It's all about being creative and trying different things. So, said I needed raw meat. Do I, can I talk to him again? Hmm. Any tips? <laughs> Ingredients. You can toss anything edible in there. Thankfully, you have plenty of options in the area. You remember that with the more ingredients that you use in a dish, the more health it will replenish when you eat it. Now then. Hmm. Uh, combination? Thing? The idea is to mix heartier ingredients like fish and meat with things like grains and vegetables. Spices and herbs naturally help too, but do not accidentally add things <laughs> in like bugs. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so... Inventory. Grab a hold of whatever you want and throw it in the pot. <laughs> I'm learning buttons still, old man. You can sit back down. Alright, so... Oh, hold. Cook? Take a look at what you cooked up there, shall we? <laughs> not bad, certainly not. Oh, well, screw you. Uh, I can explain. <laughs> that said, if you do end up figuring out how to create that dish I wrote about, my warm double is all yours. If it's raw meat, then you're after, try hunting in the Force of Spirits. You'll find it in the northern part of the plateau. Probably gonna cut out the fight because that was just a really <laughs> that was a really bad showcase of everything. Throwing spear. 
Huh, that's pretty cool. Get our seared steak. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, we'll hold on to that. What's this? Bomb it. Oh, okay. Alright. I am going to go to the Forest of Spirits and look for food. I will be back when I'm there. Is that... Oh, my God. Oh, friend. Whoops. Hunting demands a great deal of focus. It keeps your mind off the battle, but your back hurts from crouching all day. First, crouch down and approach your prey quietly to ensure you will not be noticed. Huh? When you're close enough that detection is nearly imminent, draw your bow and let your arrow fly. Aim thoughtfully, and you should be able to take down your prey in a single arrow. Oh, not bow, I need arrows. Arrows. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh god, no, he's seen us. Oh, messed that up. Okay. Does he already see me? <laughs> oh, I got him. Oh, my meat. That took really long, guys. I cut out all the fails. <laughs> that took really long, though. As you can see, it's 6.15 on a bright early morning. And we just slayed a little piggy that's going to feed us for days. <laughs> oh, ho, ho. Mm -hmm. How's the shrine exploration going? My back is aching. I'm clearing it to a break. Okay. <laughs> How do I... Okay, let's figure this out now. So I'm guessing I use campfire? Hold? Drop? <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's how you do it. I might just put the stuff in. There we go. Alright, so that's lit. So now we're gonna hold the pepper and hold the raw meat. And we're gonna cook them up. <laughs> Spicy pepper steak. Grants low level cold resistance. The meat has been cooked and crushed in pepper. Store. Ah, neat. Okay. Ooh. I cooked something. Let's take a look at what you cooked up there, shall we? 
<laughs> not bad. Oh, it's not it. Hmm. There's something else. Hmm. Here, let's get another meat real quick then. Mother trucker. As soon as you poke your little head up. Come on. Swallow your last but Come on, dude. I got scared. <laughs> I got scared. Apparently, I need to find a way to get fish. I don't know how to get fish, but I have cold resistance, so I'm just, I'm going to go for it. I got two foods that will give me cold resistance, and we'll see if that's enough to, enough to last. I think I read somewhere you can also go to the top. I'm assuming this is the top right here of the mountain to um, get the armor that gives you cold resistance but I'm gonna cut back I'm gonna see you guys when I'm back here I read that's how you catch fish you whistle Alright, I guess the fish you don't want to be caught, so we'll just come back to it. Alright, and we're back here. We got some spicy peppers in case we mess this up. Let's get going. So we got... That. Alright, so now we can go into the cold. I think the first goal should be trying to go find him. He's, he's at the top. I'm hoping it doesn't get colder. It's probably going to get colder. But we'll, we'll see. Kind of good with the combat. Let's see what we got from here. Ooh, arrows. Arrows are always good. I think I can blow that up too. Oh. Pick up. No, pick. No, come back. Come back.
Oops. Alright, try it again. Take two. Throw it. Boom. What do we get? Baked apple? Acorn. Okay, cool. Alright, let's keep on going up. I feel like I should have brought more food. Okay, so we don't have that much cold resistance. So I think we're gonna go over here actually, get this. I think it'll be a fast travel. We'll be able to leave, restock up, and then come back and find Old Man at the top of the mountain. And I think that'll be a good way to end the episode, actually doing something. <sighs> I'll tell you what, this game is a lot harder than I thought it'd be. Okay, so there's that. Okay, that works too. Alright, and we're here. Finally. I have a lot of editing to do on this episode. I promise, guys, I'm not that slow. I just never played a Zelda game before. I'm just kidding. I'm very slow. But we're making progress. Slowly but surely, I'm learning the game. I actually know how to draw my bow and draw my weapon now. I under I finally figured out the correlation between the two buttons. Oh, wow. To you who sets foot in this shrine, I am Oa Dame. In the name of God is Tila, I offer this trial. See what power up we get this time. The bomb's cool, but the bomb's killed me twice already, so <laughs> I don't know how much I want to use it. Stop the flow of time for an okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Is it limited? Okay. Well, that's good to know. All the time in the world. That's pretty cool. Let's see what we get in here. Traveler's shield. Oh, neat. Inventory is full. Uh, no, it's not. Not for that. Uh, I mean, my shield. Yeah. Alright, let's get going. 
get our third uh, trial orb. Do I like push this? Or? That's kind of cool. I don't know if I needed to stop time to do that, but that was kind of cool. Alright. The resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. The perseverance I went through to get here is what speaks to me being a hero. Gotta smile upon you. <laughs> I need to smile in because woo, that was rough. All right, and with that, we've defeated another trial. I think we're gonna call it an episode here. I know I said I was going to do all the trials like two episodes ago, but I I have no idea what I'm doing, guys. <laughs> I'm trying my best. Um, I'm going to create more meals off screen and maybe try to figure out how to get a fish. If I can figure out how to get a fish, I'll start the next episode um, back with Odd Man and get the, get the clothes. If not, we will start the next episode off probably like right here. And we will continue on our trek up the mountain, find Old Man, and do the last trial. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see y'all next time.